A very good afternoon from here in the centre of Gibraltar. This evening we're going to take a stroll around Gibraltar. A very good morning from here in Gibraltar. A very good morning guys from here in Casemate Square. So guys, we're back in Gibraltar for another episode. Welcome back. I hope you enjoyed the Andorra series, but I'm all Andorra'd out now. And I'm sitting in one of my favourite places. The weather is beautiful today. It's 24 degrees, the sun is shining. It's just the most perfect day for my day off. And I was thinking what content we're going to film today. And I was sitting on one of my favourite benches where I think about what we're going to film. And someone's left their mobile phone. So first job of the day, first good deed of the day. Let's go and give this to the gathers. Come on. I mean, they're pretty lucky it's a shit phone, otherwise I'd be giving it to my Indian mate on Main Street and not the police. No, that was only a joke, guys. But come on, let's do our first good deed and hopefully our only good deed of the day. Come on. So here we are, and I've got some lovely shots of the town area as we make our way towards Casemate Square. Now, this is the old police station as we're looking for the new police station. And just as we're here, a couple of coppers walk oh, past. sorry, guys. One sec. I was just coming to find you, I found a phone up in the Governor's Parade. So, Parade? Yeah, no, no absolutely, so you take that, yeah? yeah. yeah. Um, no, it looked like there was battery on there, it was what, 60%? Oh, yeah, it has. Yeah, 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 yeah. Absolutely. No worries, thank you very much. All right, no problem at all, take care. And Bosch, there's our good karma, so let's hope this video gets a million views. So here we are guys, 26 degrees here in the square it's saying on the thermometer and the phone has been reunited so all good news but I don't know what we're going to do today so let's just go for a little aimless walk and uh, see if we can create content as we walk, come on guys. You see once you've been to one place here in Gibraltar you've been to them all like I'm trying to think of new places to take you guys on the channel. Maybe we might head over to the new Marina Bay Club. But I was saving that for a different video. I don't want to expend all my content for no reason, just for having a walk about and just trying to find something to capture. But might have to be, might have to be. Let's continue our walk and exploration around town today and just, yeah, see if something interesting will happen on this beautiful Wednesday afternoon. The thermometer saying 26 degrees here and today is the 15th of May. Well at least we got rid of that phone, that's one good thing eh? So all we need is a bit more luck on our side, either a decent video or maybe I'll find a one on the floor, who knows. But come on, let's keep exploring. So that's it guys, it's official, I'm all out of content for Gibraltar. Ocean Village, we've been there, Queensway Quay, we've been there, Main Street, how many times we've done that? Let's go check out the new marina. A complex little artificial island built in between Ocean Village and the runway. Come on guys. So let's have a look at some of these stunning shots here from Ocean Village and you can see the summer is really starting here as we're in mid-May. What a beautiful day it is here. I couldn't walk past without taking a couple of shots here of Ocean Village and you could be fooled by thinking you were in Barbados or Bermuda with this beautiful weather and beautiful scenery but come on let's push through to the Marina Bay Club and let's take a look and see what the hype's all about come on guys so here we are guys we've arrived at the Marina Bay entrance and look at this there is a massive private yacht to greet us so what we're going to do is we're going to have a look around the complex and get to know it come on guys so I think it's very fair to say that this place here, Marina Bay Club, is very reminiscent to Sotter Grande or this American design of building where you've got these beautiful modern buildings behind me and if I spin around, I don't want to get the glare of the sun, but if you spin around you can tow your boat right up to here and just walk into your house and as well where I'm standing you have parking spaces as well. So this place is really catering for everything. But let's have a little walk around the building here and let's see if we can explore some more things come on guys i really couldn't have picked a better day to do this video the weather is absolutely fantastic just hovering around 26 degrees so i can confirm yes you can wear your shorts now in gibraltar look at this place come on this is how the other half live really i mean if i showed you the comparison to my little place in the town area 
compared to one of these gaffs here and look at the surroundings and the settings you've got Spain just behind us here you've got the runway it's just perfect isn't it and look at how beautiful and colorful the buildings are now if I'm really lucky I've got a mate who lives here to here and if I ask him really nicely maybe he'll take us inside and let us look at the pool area but for now let's continue exploring the Marina Bay Club come on guys now I really like this little park it's a nice little feature but no dogs allowed but We'll have a look around here and as you can see they've brought in a little cannon, polished it up and it just, yeah, it's definitely Gibraltar. Everywhere you go in Gibraltar you see these cannons just on the street, on the sides and there is significance because these were the weapons that used to protect Gibraltar back in the day. I mean look at this, they've even built a little park for residents which dogs are not allowed in. This is absolutely fantastic, they've really thought about everything with this place, it feels like you actually escape in Gibraltar but while you're still in Gibraltar if that makes sense it feels like an exclave of sorts but yeah come on guys let's keep continuing exploring this beautiful new development here and I bet if you're wondering how much one of these places will set you back to be honest with you I'm not in a position to buy any property at the moment because I'm not so I'm on the rented market and I know a studio in this place here is going to set you back £1,500 a month. So yeah, I hope that gives you just some idea. There are two and three bed places in here. So just imagine you're looking at two, three grand a month just to stay here. But come on guys, let's keep exploring. So you have a nice shot of the runway here, which means you must get some nice views if you are facing outside of the airport and the planes landing but come on let's keep walking through and this place just looks so beautiful on the camera looking back at it now just all the colors are out and there's just nothing better than Gibraltar in the sunshine but look at these modern clean new apartment buildings I mean whether you're coming here on holiday or whether you're looking to live and move in this complex I mean you're gonna have a good time ain't you and if you're on this bit I think you've got the best views of the whole complex as you're staring out towards the rock so I think we've completed our circuit now of the Marina Bay Club we've seen the yachts parked in and we've seen these beautiful buildings now let me see if I can knock my mate up and see if he'll let us look at the swimming pool area I think that's what most people actually want to see I've heard it's really really impressive I went up there when they were building it but I haven't seen it since it's been built and since the swimming pools have been filled up guys so come on if we're really lucky you'll let us have a look around so let's take one last look here at the marina as we make our way on top of the complex and this is the swimming pool area although looking back on it I didn't get a very good shot of the swimming pool you've got to remember there were people and residents up here so I've kind of got to be respectable when people are enjoying their holidays or enjoying their free time as they may not wish to appear on camera which of course is their right as I am in a private area but just look at these stunning views and just sitting down on those lovely table and chairs as you look out over Ocean Village, The Rock, you've got Spain there, you can see another yacht, that one has a helicopter on top, it's just stupid money here really, but yeah, beautiful. So that's it from me here at the Marina Bay Club in Gibraltar, and I think we found a little jewel here, just very close to Ocean Village, so if you're a lucky person who's staying here on Airbnb, this is what you can expect, or if you're moving to Gibraltar, this is what you can expect to find if you want to stay here, but from me here, in Marina Bay Club. Thank you for watching as always and I'll see you all on the next adventure.